everyone peace of Christ to all today we are going to take another letter which is the letter Th now just to remind you before we took from the alphabet already you can go back if you don't see the rest of the videos we took the letter Aleph A Ba Ta and now we will take Th now the letter Th is simply as you are saying in English thunder thunder so th, th, thunder. It's not sa, no, th, th, thunder. So let us see how this letter is written and how we can make it uh, uh, easy to memorize it and remember it and how to, uh, to write it down. This is how we see, as usual, the letter by itself in the beginning, and this is the letter connected, and this is the letter in the middle and this is the letter at the end you will see that all those letters they are very similar to each other as you see ta, tha, etc except letters we mentioned to you before if you remember just to refresh your memory again letter a da the ra za wa those they don't accept connection in the left but the rest they are similar you know as you see uh, ba, this is how it is. Ta, this is how it is. It's the same. Tha is the same. Very simple. So let us see uh, how we write it down using the pen. It's very simple. It's almost the same as we wrote the letter ta and ba. The only difference, this one have a three dots at the top. So the difference between uh, later i'm going to make the uh, i will uh, like after we finish the alphabet i'm going to uh, organize the letters for you uh, to put them in groups so you will see the similars together and those who they are like uh, we will group them in the easiest way uh, to make you memorize them more and faster so this is letter th as we see in the front of our eyes here it is like a dish and you put three dots as simple as that in the beginning you say tha. in the middle if it's between two letters it is like this and this is how it is if it is at the end so we learn about ba just to refresh your memory the ba the dot is underneath and here if the ba in the beginning and here if the ba is in the middle and this is here if the ba at the end and we learn about the letter ta if it is alone independent ta in the beginning ta in the middle and ta at the end so again we just to refresh your memory again the letters at the end always they go to the original shape except there is a connection little bit of connection here this is the original shape so when we put them at the end they go back to the original in the first and between they change because in the beginning there is no connection and we have to connect it and this is how it can look like you know with this connection and here this is for connection and this is for connection all right so now what we notice here that this letter have three dots in the top there's a letter have one dot underneath and there's a letter have two dots in the top so this is tha this is ba and this is the ta very simple very easy now let us write a word with the letter tha so you see how we can write it down uh, I will write a word start with the letter tha in the beginning so we will write the word thaur thaur mean cow the male cow thaur the first letter is tha thaur thaur that's a male cow uh, there is a city muhammad after he occupied that city he killed the people of it the Jews and he changed the name from the original name which is 
يثرب يثرب يا اث يثرب so the second letter here is the letter ث now uh, let us see a word end with the letter uh, ث حرث حرث like when you dig in the in the ground if you are uh, uh, let us say you are a farmer and you dig in the floor to put your seed that is called حرث uh, like in the Quran it says your women is your حرث which mean your women is the same as a floor you dig in it in a very insulting way so حرث mean you dig to put a seed so حرث the letter ث here it's coming at the end let us highlight it this is حرث and this is the last letter in the in the word so let us write one more option uh, actually um, hold on let us do this uh, I'm trying to make this board all right so again the letter th is very e easy to write this is the letter th by itself three dots this is in the beginning and this is in between and this is at the end go back to the original so we said thawr you see later you will be writing fast right thawr and harth now let us see uh, a word the letter tha appear in the middle muthalath Muthalath. This this word have two tha, which is unique. In the beginning, we don't we have the letter mim, m. Let us highlight. Okay. This is the letter mim. And then this letter is l. And the one stay in red is the tha. So tha in the middle. And tha at the end, you see how it look like? Muthalath. Muthalath is a rectangle square, like a, a, a shape. So, uh, if we go here, oh, this is the wrong one, sorry. This is Muthalath. All right, this is the shape of Muthalath. This is what the word means. So I think this is very easy, and we learn how to write it down. And the second video, we will move to the letter after it. With this, I will say thank you, God bless, and don't forget to subscribe to our video and share with your friends and let them go and join us. Thank you.